Well, we all know how important Santa Claus is to many children this time of year. But in Montreal, there's another man who also goes around spreading cheer. His name is Norman Brown, but he's known as Dr. Toy. That's because for about 20 years now, he's handed out toys to young patients in Montreal's pediatric hospitals. Cindy Sherwin has a story in tonight's Power of One. Yes, yes, absolutely great. When it comes to toy shopping, Norman Brown is a big kid himself. Absolutely, this is very good. They can create, they can create designs on this, right? Wow. He and daughter Melissa are choosing toys to hand out to children at the Shriners Hospital. Many of the items are donated. Well, let's get two more toys and then uh, that's it for the toy doctor for today. It all started about 20 years ago when Norman was able to fix a child's broken toy for him. The child's delight led to a personal revelation. I couldn't make a difference. So Norman and his daughter Melissa set out to do that every year. A simple and kind gesture that resonates. Look what happens when you turn this on. Music. Ah, oh, that's cute. With both the patients and their families. It's a big uh, smile in the day for. Her. This is about cooking. Yeah. Twelve-year-old Rodrigo is here from Peru for an operation. For me? Yes, Star Wars. Oh, thank you. And muy generous. Very generous. Yeah. And he's a good person. I got this uh, autograph for you from the hockey player. Hall of Famer. Oh, nice. Oh, wow. Wow. For you. Oh, wow. Wow. Thank you very much. All right. Sweet. Even the big kids here enjoy the kind-hearted visitor. I feel good about it because uh, I've put, I put a smile into that child's face. He wasn't expecting to, a situation like this to happen, and, it, and, it, and that makes me happy. We uh, rely a lot on volunteers and people that come in and make the kids uh, happy, and so we are really uh, pleased to have somebody like the toy doctor. Melissa Brown is overcome as her dad has his moment. I was really trying to hold on my tears. But at the same time, I was really, really happy. It really touched my heart. He hopes she'll take over one day, but not yet. I'm 60, and I'm when I'm I'm gonna go until I until the motor doesn't work anymore. Dr. Toy could be called Dr. Joy to the kids, and it's hard to know who's having more fun. Yeah. I have a little, a little present for you. A little gift for you. Okay. Cindy Sherwin, CTV News.